Hey guys, Guiball here. So, earlier I had a video of playing Alpharius and explaining the deck a little bit. Um, the game crashed, so I had to stop that video uh, after an hour or so in. I'm gonna continue here. And what I'm hoping for this time around is actually to show you some games against some uh, other Primarchs, other uh, Warlords. Um, let's see how it goes there. So this is a little slow, even though it's an amazing card. We are oh yeah, legion. this. No mercy. Normally I don't keep this as well. That was an oversight. from the shadow. But anyways. So Corvus, Corvus. I'll just create a trap and then change. This is about victory, true victory. I don't really need any of the uh, Raven Guards cards. Okay, so I already took this. Let's um, play this and make a copy of the other one. I have one more pack and be a little aggressive. Let's see how that goes. War Master. I remember this opponent. So I played him before. Um, I think he's pretty decent, if I remember correctly. So, and there I drew my second one. So any the other Rhino will not generate any card for me. Hmm. I'm at nine cards. Make him draw. Let's draw. Oh wow, we drew Coleman. That's. Pretty decent. So I find with um, Corvus being aggressive is usually better. Okay. draw his what's that card that reveals stealth units okay uh, that's the stun let's do this let's draw that's not it and I have 10 cards so my next card is gonna be discarded but that's okay three six nine. Oof. Oh no, not that one. Don't discard that. I probably needed that to like finish him off. Uh, okay. That's stun. Do 4 damage and stun. And let's return him to Coleman so we can actually flank him later. So all we're almost reaching turn 8, the harrowing, which is where we will wipe his board. We're just delaying, right? Got nine cards. He's probably gonna play one. We'll play some secret orders on it. Make him draw a card. Stun him at the same time. Okay, no minion.
I want to put minions where he needs to like remove, right? Um, that way. It kind of like distracts him. So he knows I have this in hand. Ten. Ten cards. Perfect. Turn eight. We're at turn eight. Come on. You can't empty his hand, right? And he can go stealth all he wants, but with the harrowing, he's just, I'm gonna wipe his board. That's the card I wanted to reveal stealth, but anyways, it doesn't matter. Thank you. Thank you. Goodbye. So this deck is actually pretty effective against Corvus. Um, this is about the third or fourth Corvus I'm playing again with Alfer against uh, against Corvus with Alpharius. And, um, I won the, the the other three 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 times. So let's see. Of course, I can always change. Um, huh. He's got twelve cards in hand. Okay. A demon. Let's see what he's got. Oh, ah, didn't really do anything. Oh yeah, this has flank. What am I gonna do with that? I'm not gonna attack. <laughs> I actually want to make it harder for him to clear my board so I can do damage to um, his Corvus. Oh. So we can do two, four. He has to remove this or that. Two, four, and then if he's not stealth mode, oh no, we can't really. Ah, okay. Come on, return to friendly. Okay. Okay. Oh. This would force him to play that card and um, him which means he won't be able to <sighs> what to do three six nine let's draw a card oh so we have many ways to like kill him many ways Nevermore. I think yeah, he just came. Nice. So not the highest rank, but pretty decent, almost 4k. This is a popular uh, lodge. So there you go against Corvus. Let's see who else. Where's Fulgrim? Oh, another alpha lead. That works. Let's see how this goes. I think Alpharis is still the strongest among the Alpha Legions. Of course, we he is their primarch. Legion. We are Alpharius. Yes, he's revealing himself early. A harrowing is coming. And that's weird because if you were this guy, you why would you reveal yourself early? You you, you can only damage and stun troops, which works with secret orders, right? Um, but you should collect. In my opinion, I think you should collect traps. Um, I'm gonna attack. I want this guy to die, but for the first turn, 
I actually want to copy your cards because this is about victory. True victory. They're my cards. Okay. This guy has an interesting effect. He just shows up on the enemy board and then he deals one damage to the enemy warlord per turn. And he starts off stunned. So um I don't find it particularly strong, it's just an interesting card with an interesting effect. But yeah. him I want to stun him that's the uh, trick Sending him back. And dealing two damage to two damage and stunning this guy. He's gonna kill this guy for sure. But I think being aggressive is the right thing to do right now. Okay, what's he have? Ooh. Ooh. Obviously he's not playing Gamma on this. Um, right, so... I mean, I'd be surprised if he was. He probably played Gamma on this. That was a little predictable. You wouldn't play Gamma on the one. Um, I want to get rid of him as well. So, yeah. Three. Let's 
see how I find like secret orders. I only have two in my deck. Why? Because it's they're situational. I don't really just use them all the time, right? Um, even the three that I have this game, I, I don't think I really used it. So. Three, three, six. So, oh man, one energy away from lethal. But so he stunned my guy and put a whatever. What's that gonna do? At this point, actually, you know what? I don't know what I'm thinking. Uh, nice try. up against like a 4k player. Durin Rask. 4k plus player. Just to show how good this deck potentially can be. Um, I don't know this player. I don't I don't know what rank he's at. We are Legion. But it's a death For guard again. We love copying death guards. So This is about victory. True victory. Okay. He's going to play it. I'll play mine. Being aggressive. Hmm. Can can he be aggressive? I mean, can he play his deck as an aggro? Oh yeah, maybe. Wow. I can be aggressive too, but do I want to be? Uh, yeah, why not? not sure if that's the right card to play. Now you have no board. You don't care. See this guy, I, I, you haven't seen me, I haven't played him really. I'm wondering if I should swap him out for something. But anyways, draw a card. Ooh. If, I, if I play it, he can play it right back on me, right? <laughs> um, and I want to play this anyway. Oh, wait, he can just attack me and kill this and then play that Mortar Strike anyways. Played too early. Okay, he didn't do it, but he has something similar. Plus, it's a minion. This is a vehicle, so I can't use Gamma Order on it. Nicely played. And he's 
see his hand is very low. He's uh, effectively dodging this. He can deal four damage. Potentially we lost already, deal 4 damage, stun the target, manages and units. I don't think that's a good, good strategy. Is that could be good. Uh, maybe I should have killed this. The 4 damage. He has the mortar strike as well. Copy his second endurance. But uh, what are the odds, right? It's not gonna happen. So So not favored against Durin Rask. Oh. We played him before, do we win? I forget. guarantee that we don't die is to do this so he doesn't attack us or if he tries he like you know hurts himself instead um, he can do four damage if he has another endurance or that I will have my revenge you do what you must and he has the second endurance in hand already so there's no way we would have copied it oh Nice. So here we're getting some stronger players. And we're losing. <laughs> it's okay. Vulcan again. So this is going to be another long game. But I think we can win. And this might be my second. I might end it soon. Zanjai. Okay, so this is the same guy we played against before. We are Legion. So comes the moment. So he goes first, which I don't remember if he went first last time. But him going first this time is definitely an advantage for him. Um, I want to copy this card. This is about victory. True victory. We're going to play Jubak next, if he doesn't have anything threatening. I think I should change this. I mean, his effect is so strong, as long as he's on the board, any troop the enemy plays will be stunned, which delays them by a lot. And in this deck, you want to delay the enemy, but I don't find myself playing this that much. So here, do I care about that guy? I can remove it, but... Uh. Let's copy his cards. Oh, it's not a salamander. Well, Gold's home's okay. Stormy. 
Stunning it. Oh, yeah. Doing two damage does make a difference. Stunning it. So, what's he gonna do? He has to attack. So that's it. That was a bad turn four for him. Let's pop another card. Let's play this. We're just delaying. another one and then play this front line but I want to remove this or at least send it back up but sending it back up I could save that for something else oh, no. Let's do that. So he doesn't know I have a second gold stone. Um, let's see. Uh, oh, this is a turn for kind. We can actually play this. And, uh, yeah. Let's see. Uh, sorry, my son is just my son is calling me, so I'm just responding to him. <laughs> Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I can't get it. I Sorry, that was just the wife calling. Let's put back the music. Alright, let's see, where are we at? Um stunned him three six seven. So I want to stun him again, right? And do some more threats. We're preparing for lethal here with the harrowing. Um, Eight cards. He's gonna play a few, but he's always stunned. So he's doing two damage to himself all the time. We're gonna bring him down, do the harrowing, and kill him one turn. Next one. 
next turn. Five. He's got five. Okay, five. Ugh. Five is not really. Is it enough? I can make it six, which is five actually because he has a whisper card. Eight. We'll do five. This five. That's not enough. That is not enough. So we're gonna do another turn of. So he knows the harrowing is coming. Lethal because <laughs> we can only deal three damage. The war will end. But he gave up. Okay. Night Hunters. Gave up. Okay, so still tenth. Haven't been really moving much. Um you uh, one defeat every now and then but we're doing pretty well with Alpharius considering uh, it's not the top deck in the rank that we're at um, let's see I'll do one last battle Kids are starving. I need to feed them. <laughs> uh, so I'll do one last we battle, and then I'll, I'll, I'll go do that. Charge! Abandon supplies. Yeah. cards I do I didn't want to copy the cards but I want to copy and cards of the same legion um, usually different uh, usually they have the same cards as well why what's the difference okay I feel like Legion's actually I regret that <laughs> Probably giving Angron cards is not the best idea. So uh, yeah. I immediately regretted it after revealing my identity. That's okay. Should be okay. Let's see. I beat Angron before. Yeah. 
doesn't play a lot of units though, so makes it kind of hard. Good or not, because he has one. <laughs> um, he's the aggro deck, so it's probably better for him. Yeah. And he's going face. Defense rights? Okay, perfect. Three damage as needed. Um, of course. I'm gonna play this guy. Down. What could he do to kill him? He could do Sedition's Gate if he had like a cheap unit to sacrifice. Cleave works yeah. in two turns, not one. So. Cleave only works though if you're not stunned. Three, six, nine. I have ten cards. Okay, I, maybe I don't know if I should have done that, but anyways. He has another one. Okay. And he's not stunned. Okay, um, oh, oh. Look at that, a ghost legionary that's actually in ghost mode. He used up the no survivors already. Does he have an artillery strike? Oh, ouch. Why does he have that? I need to send it back. Actually, wait. Three, six, seven, eight. Uh, I can make him draw a nine and he would still have it. But I have to send it back anyways. Right. And I can use this to stun it when it comes back. Pretty close. Who's gonna take the win? If he has armor of Mars, I think I lost. Oh. Okay, strike up there. So that prevented him from playing the demon. I have another one. But it. Oh no. No, that's not good. Um. Play this again. It's gonna cleave, so I might as well attack. Um, do this. Okay, some aggro units to finish him off. I can effectively do the five survive. <coughs> Okay, if he can't kill me, I could kill him. Probably. Oh, he forgot that he's stunned. So this unit is very useful against aggro. It removes fast. That was a mistake on his part. He should have did that first. And I think that might have cost him the game. 
Probably not. Ah. Uh, the harrowing. That would do four damage. Okay, wait. Three. Four, five. Three, four, five. No, this is four, five, six, seven. I'm down by one. I just I don't have enough. I don't have enough. I don't have enough. Missing one life. You do what you must to win. Victory. So, uh, that was close. Anyways, let's do one more. Now we're getting close to rank 11. Anyways, let's do one more. So, yeah, it's not the greatest deck, but it's a lot of fun. And um, it act it's actually quite competitive. Right? So you see I'm playing against a lot of the top players, uh, at least top 50 I guess, uh, or close to it. Actually top 50 would be probably 40, right, 4300 40, and up. Um, but some pretty decent players at least, um, and doing very well or very close to it. This is uh, another bot, I should have just stopped. Okay, anyways, last one against a bot. We um, are Legion. Colonel Ornitov. I don't really care about his deck. I don't really need this to copy. I'll take the trap. Victory. Could have killed it. It's a risk, sort of, not to. But I think I, I was willing to take that risk. Okay. Play defense satellites. Uh, he doesn't have a lot of cards. Surprisingly, for Ornatov, who draws two card, could draw two cards a turn. He doesn't have a lot. Um, You 
could have not attacked with you back there. Doesn't matter. I don't really care too much for one of the top's cards. Also, it's a way to distract the warlord to force him to attack you so that he can't use its ability. Um, so now. Drawing three, six, nine. Okay, I'll draw my tenth card. Oh wow, two of them. Well, I'm gonna kill one. That one, I guess. Um. Oh yes. So let's play this defense satellites. Clear the board. Um. Eh, how do I want to clear the board? Do that. So we're at turn eight. Turn nine is coming with score. Score. Okay, we're gonna kill that. Um, eight, eight, eight. Done him so we can't put up more defenses. Okay, he got that from Ornatov. Okay, so it wasn't originally in his deck, so that's fine. Alright, so I think let's just play score, right? There's no. We just done everyone, deal 3 damage, and it's over. 2 OP. Ah. <laughs> A fun deck to do and complete your daily missions, uh, daily, uh, yeah, your daily missions uh, at least. If nothing else. 5 minutes. Cool, where are we at? We're at 48 minutes of recording. Um, 2.10. That was against a bot. Last one. Okay, last one. Last one. For real. Bot or not, this is the last one. Vulcan. Hopefully, is it the same player? No one's playing Ferris Manus anymore. Demeter. So this is not the same player. Let's see how this Vulcan does. Um, I think Demeter might be higher rank we than We are Legion. So comes the moment. Again, we do want to copy his cards. He's being aggressive. This is about victory. True victory. are useful against the salamander so let's play him is not to use it uh, to play trap cards actually so it was just a distraction but he, he didn't play anything so really bad hand probably 
um, three, six, seven, eight. Uh, I could remove it. Could remove it. Oh wow! This is so powerful. Um, okay. I'm not sure if this would have been a better move. got 10 he's gonna discard a card so turn seven is urdra cool probably oh he's trying to kill the but then why did he attack with his with his cavalier oh. Like, he didn't need to, right? It would have killed the... Okay. I need this. So that I can remove any Salamander's guard that he sent out. I don't have a lot of healing though, so that's the dangerous part of Urdur Cool. Um, you need to be careful if you're always attacking the... Okay. No problem. Stealth, just because I know he has Urdra Cool as well, right? Uh, so anything I send out here, like if I sent uh, five, if I sent this out, he would attack. He would take five damage, but yeah, he would have died. Stealth will can probably ensure me damage. guy some 
threat on the board. He might use you or Dracul for that. But then he also has to get rid of the uh, this guy with sneak. Dawnbringer, plus two, and cleave. Ouch. Okay. Plus two and cleave. Okay. I might need this. He's down to one life if he tries to use the cleave um, to remove this and hurt me. Otherwise, four. Uh, I don't think he would have the gold. gold stones. Six. Ten. I don't think he has gold. He has to be careful that he will end up dying as well if he doesn't remove. My board. And if we either draw score or heroin, I think he's dead. Anything he plays, uh, uh, yeah, that's true. Also, like he he, he he can't have lethal because even if you had fast units, this support guy, this cover support would stun them, so they wouldn't be played. Anyway, so he needs to remove this guy first. Stun. Good try. That was a mistake. Oh! Sends out Erdur cool though. You would be able to remove this. Okay. Uh huh. Uh huh. I'm thinking. He's stunned. I don't want him to attack me. He will attack, use his Primarch's ability, um, and then you get stunned. A little tricky. He'll attack, use his Primarch's ability to revive with three survivor. This would have one life. I can then, I can then, technically, I think I can kill him. If this would heard it for two. Oh no I did not expect that oh no ten and then three ah wait okay let's see what can I do you are reborn very good Now I want to stun everyone. So he's also stunned. So it would do two damage to him. 
I need to just remove it. Oh no, I don't need to remove this. Um, but I can remove it. Let's see. Just in case. Um, do I want him to draw a card? I don't need him to draw a card. Just in case he draws something that helps him get out of this situation. Um, I should be able to kill him next. Nine, three, lethal, come on. Shoot back, doesn't do anything. Oh, uh, that doesn't do anything. Nice, and that's it, he ends his turn. Uh, around 4,000. I probably yeah brought him down a bit, but cool. I think we're down to rank 11 now with the last loss. Oh, we're still at 10. Okay, so rank didn't change. We had fun. Top 10. Playing Alpharius, pretty decent. And I think that's it, I have to stop now, right? So, um, hope you guys enjoyed. If you like it, please like the video, subscribe if you're interested, and uh, I'll see you guys later. Happy New Year's. Bye.